Man, gig tales. Mm-hmm. Good, bad, or ugly, Lou. What you got? Okay, so just a few weeks ago. So okay, so there I'm gonna start with this. There's a um there's a mother at the church. Uh she every now and again she would come up to me and will request grateful. She like if y'all could do great grateful. Yes, that I would, walk grateful. Yeah, that would bless my heart if y'all could do that. Now, mind you, I had one of them too. I'm not the person that makes the calls on what songs that's going to be done for Sunday. The only time I could probably do something uh within choice, well, it's definitely offering. But sometimes invitation depended on what's going on. So, uh a few Sundays ago, uh, she came up to me, and and uh, me, uh, the other keyboard player, and my choir director, we was talking a little bit before service starting, and she was walking towards towards me, of course, and I like, oh, I already know what she want. <laughs> so, she had a ten dollar bill in her hand, and uh, she came. He said, "Young man, I've been trying to get you to play Grateful for the last for last three weeks." Uh, uh, now I got this ten dollars. Lunch is on me. I'm gonna need you to play that song. I'm about to turn ninety, and I don't want to hear. That. I want to hear that song before I die. And, and wow. she's just going in. So then, <laughs> my choir director, when he she she mentioned about dying, he talking about, well, we can play it at your funeral. I'm like, boy, wow. <laughs> and the keyboard player, he just dying laughing. I'm like, wow. So I like, please, my <laughs> life is on the line. We got to play this song today, y'all. I feel hilarious. like my life is on the line. Did you, did you take the ten dollars? No, I didn't. I didn't, man. <laughs> keep your keep your money. Just put it off. I would have took it. Yeah, uh, I, I I wouldn't feel some kind of way taking money from from mother. So I like that's hilarious. 